I'm Joe Rosa. I've been the director at Christian Academy of Guatemala for the past 12 years, the most fulfilling in my educational career. God has been doing extraordinary things at CAG, and it has been such a privilege to be a part of what He is doing. Christian Academy of Guatemala is located in Guatemala City on five acres. The CAG facilities include a full gymnasium, a science lab, computer lab, library, band room, stage, and spacious classrooms. CAG is accredited by the Association of Christian Schools International, and its graduates attend state and private universities throughout the United States and Canada, as well as around the world. I have a daughter who's graduating from University of Michigan in April, and a son who's just starting at MIT in Boston. And not only were they accepted those schools, but they're uh, some of the top students in, in those schools. They rank high above nationwide standards in the U.S. with their SAT scores. I like my honors English class this year. Um, it's really challenging, more challenging than pretty much any English class I've ever had before. It's a, an American curriculum. We were homeschooling the first couple years and Caleb had some um, learning disabilities and that's how we found out about the school. Somebody told us about the discovery program that they have here at CAG. The teacher has come from the States with qualifications from the states to particularly meet the needs that Abigail had. For me, that is amazing. And I was thoroughly surprised and impressed by the quality of education that the students are receiving here. Whether it be education, ministering to our kids spiritually, or ministering to our family as a whole, it is done in um, a standard of excellence. Just the, the level of education is great. And I love the school. The student body numbers 220 students, of which 75% are the children of missionaries. These students represent nearly a dozen nationalities. The heart of CAG is the teachers, committed Christian men and women who not only prepare students academically, but also socially and spiritually. CAG has been one of the most healthiest Christian communities that I've ever been a part of. From the moment I stepped off the plane, I felt like I had a new family. The climate's wonderful, the people are fantastic. The fellow teachers that I teach with, the administration and the parents are all very supportive. The administration values its teachers and their families. The teachers that are here come here as missionaries like my wife and myself. They dedicate their time and because of that, their heart in serving the kids and serving us as a family really comes through in every aspect of the way that they teach. Your experience out here will impact their lives. My husband and I are Guatemalan missionaries and I have been blessed by CAG, especially the teachers that come and help our kids here in the school. These teachers in the school are making a huge difference in the lives of the students. I think that it's really amazing that we have the opportunity to be here with so many different uh, ethnicities and nationalities and how we just blend. It's one big family. The thing that I am most impressed with is how open they are with cultures and how accepting they are to everyone. We have chapel every Thursday. That's a really amazing opportunity as well. There are many service projects that students can get involved in in the school. We've also been to this place called Hermano Padro's Hospital. It's, an, it's a hospital in Antigua for um, mentally disabled children. We also have servant days, which are three days where we go out to a village or somewhere and we can help them out and make a difference. There's been a lot of spiritual growth in the school and that's I just think that's a huge blessing of how closer we are getting to God. Christian Academy of Guatemala is looking for teachers and support staff. Maybe God is calling you to serve the children of missionaries right here in Central America. Explore how you can be a part of this exciting opportunity. I feel that I have one of the most important missionary jobs here in Guatemala because without me being here helping the students, their parents who are involved in special, unique ministries throughout Guatemala wouldn't be able to stay and be here. It's been a tremendous blessing. It's been a wonderful reaffirmation of God's love for me, His commitment for me, and for my family. What I would say to any young person who is um, even contemplating coming down, I would say just to go for it. Because there are so many choices, so many places in this world to live. And I would say, why not? 
come to Guatemala, see what this place is about, get to minister. It's like being on a big adventure. To the prospective teacher struggling with the idea of leaving family and coming to a new country very far away from family and friends, I would say give it a shot. Well, come. <laughs> Guatemala is an amazing country and unfortunately so many people see the negative side of Guatemala and they're scared and they think it's frightening and horrible things are going to happen to them. We've been here for seven years and it's just been nothing but a wonderful experience. In the States I lived in uh, San Diego and had a fantastic job doing uh, commercial real estate and uh, had a great career going, had lived with a couple of, uh, had worked with a couple of different organizations but we heard the Lord's call to uh, you know do something better, do something more significant with your life. I just really felt like God was telling me that um, although he had called me into the army and I had served him there, that it was time to um, find a new vocation, one which I could serve him more directly um, and be involved in missions work. It's such a great opportunity to help others and to serve many people who are working in a ministry here in Guatemala. I feel blessed to have that privilege to help the missionaries in Guatemala to stay here and do the wonderful work that they're doing. This place is amazing. You have um, an incredible opportunity to touch lives in a way that is going to further touch the world. These kids are going to go on and serve God. Me, these kids have an incredible heart for God. But also, they need role models. They need people to show that. And living by faith has been incredibly reassuring and full of joy in our time here. Now that you've caught a glimpse of the exciting things God is doing at Christian Academy of Guatemala, I invite you to join us. Come join us, our outstanding team of educators who are dedicating their lives to the cause of Christ in Guatemala. Your students will be children of people who God has called to serve in Guatemala. Many as missionaries, others in international business or in the diplomatic corps. You will provide a quality education so these children will be prepared to serve Him in an increasingly multicultural world. You will become part of a Christian community where caring extends to the needy of Guatemala as well as to the CAG family. When is the last time you did something extraordinary for God? Maybe He is calling you to take the extraordinary step of faith to teach cross-culturally at Christian Academy. Take the challenge. Become part of what God is doing at CAG. Explore how you can be a part of this exciting opportunity.